Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Welcome back to the channel, Awesome US Movies. Today we are doing a Patreon pick, and it was um, like Thanksgiving family values or family together time or something like that. And the pick was Adam's Family Values. Now I've seen the first movie, The Adam's Family. And this is the sequel to that. I really had fun with the first one. I was confused about the children like constantly trying to like kill each other. Um, but it was I guess they're immortal or something because they can't die. They <laughs> I don't know about that. My light is in my eyeballs. Oh my gosh. But um yeah, I'm really interested to see what this second one is. If the kids are older, I don't know the time difference between when the first one was made and when the second one was made. Because, you know, now, it, like, sometimes they're like, oh, we're just going to make a couple of them and we're going to do it, like, back to back. So they, like, film one, they just, boom, we're filming the second one. And so they nobody ages. But then you get other things and they're like, holy crap, that person's, like, <laughs> ten years older or five years older. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm in, like, Terminator 1 and 2. What else have I seen? That are sequels to stuff. I don't know. I have so many movies to watch. Uh, if you don't know the backstory of me, I am an ex-farmer who grew up in the middle of nowhere and only had three channels on my TV. So we just didn't watch it. We watched like Wheel of Fortune or the news. And then um, I became a massive bookworm. And I have been for over 30 years now. Uh, I just, I cared about books and nothing associated with movies or TV or what's going on with those actors and things like that. So I just don't know who all these actors are. Um, and so my oldest children, you know, they grew up with movies and they cared about movies. They don't really like books. And uh, I wouldn't get any movie references ever. And so they convinced me to start this channel. And we've been going strong for a couple of years now. We're getting close to 20,000 subs. Click the subscribe button. And, um, yeah, our family discussions on Sunday dinners is way more around movies and stuff than me getting references to stuff. They love it. Um, and the channel is doing really well. So thank you so much for all the support. Thank you to my Patreons. They really, really, really help the channel grow. They really do. And um, thanks to you guys for, you know, liking and subscribing and coming back and watching my content. I have a ton of content now. So, yeah, thank you so much. But uh, let's get into it and let's watch the sequel to Adam's Family, um, The Adam's Family Values. It's gotten super cold here in Iowa in the last 48 hours. We've dropped like, oh, what is that? Oh, <laughs> Alan at the moon. Do we get, are we watching like all the same kids, all the same people, everybody? Let us join in grief. Dearly beloved. Yeah, these look like the same kids. The cat is still alive? How can you not beat the hand? He has nothing to pivot against. Good show, old man. <laughs> Marvelous news. I'm going to have a baby. Oh. Right now. Well, what? Did he not know? Is it torture? We. Oui. Mommy kissed daddy. And the angel told the stork, and the stork flew down from heaven, and the diamond turned into a baby. Wow. Our parents are having a baby, too. They had sex. Yeah, that's generally how it works. <laughs> oh, smack the baby. It's an Adams. It's an Adams. Okay, what's that mean? <laughs> Is it a boy or a girl? I can't remember. Is the hand called Thing, I think? But Good job! I've arranged a little surprise, my dearest. Let's see what the nursery looks like. Oh, Gomez. Big it's sharky stuff. Oh, look at the knives! The Adam's Cradle. Very creepy. I it looks like a little boy. That's not true. It is so. Why are we cutting the banisters? One of us has to go. They only need one boy. He has my father's eyes. Gomez, take those out of his mouth. Oh, yuck. <laughs> hey, kiddo. Oh, what was that? 
I, I can't, I'm trying to remember everybody's names. The baby weighs 10 pounds. The cannonball weighs 20 pounds. Which will hit the stone walkway first? The cannonball? There's only one way to find out. No! One. Wow, really high. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Why do you hate the baby? We just want to play with him. Do you think that when a new baby arrives, one of the other children has to die? Yes. Not anymore. Not anymore. Do you remember what we were like? I opened his skull and removed his brains. Brother! <laughs> Whoa! Wow! Wow! They're having fun. I'll oh, give them that. Strange men and the women who avoid them. I could, oh yeah, a lot of guys that could uh, read that book. Death to the enemies of the people of the Republic. Nice. Bring forward the evil one. Not the baby. No. Why would they leave them alone with the baby? They keep trying to kill it. Executioner, place her on the block. It's a her now. That's a good baby. Whoa. Whoa to the Republic. Wow. Dang, baby. It's been too long. You missed. <laughs> They're trying to shoot him now? It's you I'm worried about, the stress. It's just I wish I had more time to seek out the dark forces and join their hellish crusade. Oh. So it must be. But how? Children, as your new oh, nanny. Oh, no, a nanny? Let's discuss how to prevent forest fires. Prevent them? Where is that baby? Which part? Polly the oh, goodness. They're going to go through a lot of these. Hi, I'm Debbie Julinski from the agency. Oh, an agency. I believe we may have a new nanny. Isn't he a lady killer? Acquitted. Acquitted? <laughs> oh. Pubert. Wow, we're infatuated already. What's his name? Pubert. Pubert. I just want to grab him and squeeze him till there's not a breath left in their tiny little bodies. <laughs> Weird. This is Miss Jelinski, our new nanny. I bet sometimes you wish it was still just the two of you. Or less. Uh. <laughs> or less. He likes you. <laughs> I'm good with my hands. Uh-huh. One Dirty. family. <laughs> There's one fella I haven't met yet. Fester, come out here. Oh, Fester, that's right. Fester is his name. <laughs> they keep dropping the baby. I hope that someday you'll know the indescribable joy of having children and of paying someone else to raise them. At first. Oh. <laughs> you'll meet someone, someone very special, someone who won't press charges. Someone who won't press charges. And what's this? Mom. Oh, mom. That's creepy. Tonight on America's most disgusting unsolved crimes, we investigate the case of Ursula. Oh. Three very different women with one thing in common. Murder. And they're all the same woman. Is that her? She mates and she kills. He's on Forbes? On the wedding night, she kills them. But the money never lasts. <laughs> and soon the Black Widow is hungry again. She only has $3.81. <laughs> Oh, what's with the fireballs? Is that coming out of his mouth or other places? That's a big weight. Jeez. We'll be going out for most of the morning. Goodbye, Fester. Say goodbye to Debbie. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Stacks and bonds. Uh huh. Are the kids Treasure? watching? There she is, right there. Kill you, little brat. He's not a brat. Why did you come here? Uh, to be a nanny? Take care of you. Especially my uncle. Yeah, she knows what you're up to. They swore me to secrecy. They're afraid you'll think that they don't love you. What is she talking about? How can we say no? Don't even mention it to them. Uh-huh. Where are we sending them? Summer, summer camp. camp. Oh, summer camp? I did not see this coming. Look at all the other children. Their freckles. Their... <laughs> Gave a cigar. Why are you dressed like somebody died? Oh, Don sure. Buckman. Oh, it's the guy from uh, Raising Arizona. Our Amanda's already skipped two grades. How about your boy? Probation. Probation. 
Oh, Wednesday's at that very special age when a girl has only one thing on her mind. Boys. Homicide. Homicide. Sure. That's another option. And we're all here to learn and to just plain have fun! Wow, are they excited! I did like camp when I was a kid. I think I went to two my whole life. Store with me on there, please. This is it. You oh my gosh! Look at Pugsley in the back. He's hanging himself. Who is that man over by the punch bowl? That oddly sensual man? This is weird. Ooh, nice shot. Oh, we're moving it constantly. She makes me think of vinyl chemicals. I've dreamed that sometime maybe there might be someone for me. Yeah. But I want more. Oh, jeez. Did you see a turn? If I asked her, would you come? You and Morticia. Of course. A double date. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I swallowed it. Life saving. Earn those certificates. Amanda, Wednesday. Is that your bathing suit? Is that your overbite? <laughs> now, Amanda, jump in. Swim out a few yards and start drowning. <laughs> Oh, goodness. I can't swim. Oh, she didn't want to save her anyways. Ooh, are we at dinner already? We're moving forward fast. My wife loves violin. She's a sucker for it. Oh, it's just lovely. Isn't it, Fester? He's a little shy. Fester is truly continental. He spent many years abroad. He speaks 12 languages. Wow. When I first saw him, I thought he was from Europe. When I took a bath. I don't get that joke. Yeah, I just can't tell. Does he like me at all? Of course he does. He vomited. Uh, that's a positive? How can I be like you? Oh, I forgot. The Fester is Doc from Back to the Future, right? It's the voice. We are unworthy of such splendor. Yeah. Are you going to talk uh, about that? That's right. We should have ugly girls. Uh, that didn't come across well. <laughs> Uh-oh. Time to dance. I know that look. I can't remember. What was the dance at the end of the last one? Babushka or Mamushka or Mamushka? Mamushka. Mamushka. I think that's what it was called. Wow. Very good dancer. Whoop. <laughs> well, now it's his turn to get flipped. Clams? Hilarious. The clams. <laughs> oh, jeez. A little hard on the teeth. Faster, you need to work on your... Wow. Look at him go. Gosh. Woo! Faster needs to work on his communication skills a little bit. You have to continue the ghost story. This is dumb. Well, if you can't do it... Yeah, I bet she's got a better one. The ghost returned to the haunted cabin, and he said to the campers, None of you really believe in me, so I'll have to prove my power. And the next morning, when the campers woke up, all of their old noses had grown back. <laughs> oh, no! Not their old noses! I must bore you. Oh, <gasps> never! Oh, goodness. I have a confession. I'm a virgin. Right. I have a confession to make as well. Okay. I want to. But with your looks, you... Oh, okay. Women must follow you everywhere. Store detectives. Door detectives, not women. Dream that when I met him that we would wait until our wedding night to make the ultimate sacrifice. A goat? A goat? He's not getting it. I love you. Whatever. I love you. This. Debbie. Okay, yeah, huh. Look at him. So peaceful. <sighs> this. Oh my gosh, he's got the silence of the lion's lap on, his lamb's mask on. Go, miss. Morticia, I'm engaged. Oh, we're engaged now. That's a massive ring. That ring? It was our mother's. She was buried with it. Oh. <laughs> they dug her up. Oh, no. Uh oh yeah, the news comes out, right? Uncle Fester is getting married. Get out of the cabin. I mean, I'll kill myself. The help? 
I think their whole oh, family is like goodness. some weird medical experiment. She's positive. What did you say? Campers! <laughs> Group hug. Wednesday. She, well, she didn't do anything wrong. They're just shy. We're not shy. We're contagious. Oh. Contagious, okay. How long do we have to stay in Make here? Make my day. Until we crack. A brief history of time. I wouldn't make a bird hockey. Wow. <laughs> Michael Jackson, he'd heal the world? Why are you scared? There they oh, wow. We're really getting in trouble. We have to see our family. More important than making new friends. More important than sharing. Yes. Do you know what I think our little ninja friends here need? What? Kumbaya, my All right. lord. A sing along. Uh, He's trying to escape. Get me away from these nutty people. Have you met my husband, cousin It? Oh, that's right, cousin It. We were blessed with our own little bundle of joy. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Precious. We've had offers. Offers for what? Uh, oh, a cake. Ta da! Nobody's there. That poor girl. Oh! Was she in there before you baked? No! What? That's not creepy at all. Are you really allergic to almost everything? Oh. No, allergic you're not. To everything? Do you know what happens if my mom uses a fabric softener? I die. Oh, she likes that. I need to ask you something. Do you believe in the existence of evil? Did you meet my mom? My Uncle Fester <laughs> is about to get married. Do you want to come? I'd love to. And they, she has a date. Is the wedding. In the graveyard? Oh, surprised they didn't have her wear black. Is it the master of ceremonies? I do hereby declare my unending love. I will worship you forever. Oh, goodness, Every... Fester. Nice. <laughs> nice. Ditto. Ha <laughs> ha ditto. Maybe she just got done watching Ghost. What a dragon. Oh. Now you have to get married. Tramp. Tramp? Who's the dead guy? Was that the priest? Oh, Hawaii? The key ingredient to a successful Hawaiian honeymoon is romantic music. Why are we, uh, aren't those it's battery so powered? Far. Oh, yeah, he's trying to kill him. Buffy. Yeah, he, he's tough to kill. He's not like your other ones. No, you're nervous. He's obviously wearing like a fat suit. Please, what is it? What do you need? What? Only you. I'm ready. Just one thing. Don't oh, told goodness. Me. No giggling. And? No hand puppets. No hand puppets? <laughs> I'd love you can never see your family again. What? Otherwise, I could never really give myself completely. Yeah, what? No. Don't you want me? <laughs> oh my gosh. Manipulation. Vodka and an egg? Worcestershire? That's weird. No. Hair to the pup. Dear Wednesday and Pugsley, I love you dearly, but I can never see you again. When you are grown up and very lonely, you will understand. His haircut is funny. It's completely shaved except for one little tiny part. Oh, bald eagle. Fucking bald eagle. Oh. But aren't they extinct? <laughs> they are now. They're not extinct, no. Very much this thriving. If I have to be seen with you, we need to make some changes. Oh, goodness, what are we doing? Oh, he got a wig. Fester, get over here. Give me a kiss. Give me a 20. My goodness, what has he got himself into? And I can never see you again. P.S. Debbie says hi. <laughs> Debbie says hi. He can't be serious. At his command, I would crawl on my belly through hot coals and broken glass. Why wait? Why wait? <laughs> There's such tormentors. Post honeymoon malaise. It's very common. Do you remember our honeymoon? That glorious cruise. No survivors. No survivors? What's the body count for these two? Like, real body count. I got him. Schizos and serial killers. But look, the Black Widow. Yeah, there she is. My own personal salute to the first Thanksgiving. Oh, this is how the how it's getting pulled into the Thanksgiving theme. 
for the leading role of Sarah Miller. Our They're doing some type of Thanksgiving play. We have selected Amanda Beckman <laughs> in roles of her pilgrim pals, <laughs> Michelle and Melissa. Gee, all of her friends in the front row. Let's not forget our cheery little Chippewas, Consuela, Irwin, Jamal, and as their leader, horrible people, our own little brunette outcast, Wednesday Adam. Did she hear it? Yeah, she heard it. <laughs> that should be interesting play. We want to see Debbie and Festa. Push the gates of hell. It's the gates of hell. Might we see my brother? No, he doesn't want to see you, any of you. Why not? Because he's in love. He hates your guts. She just makes crap up constantly. Let me hear this from his own lips. You want to talk to these people? Debbie, go away! Wow, that is whip. not my brother. You have placed Vester under some strange sexual spell. I respect that. I, re I respect that. You have taken him from us. All that I could forgive. But Debbie. What? Pastels. Get out of <laughs> Push and burn! What is she doing? Just to curse. Just a curse. <laughs> I demand justice. Oh, we went to the cops. Good. She took him to Hawaii. Get out of here. They have moved into a large, expensive home where they make love constantly. I hate when that happens. Arrest her at once without delay. Who? The temptress of Waikiki. Waikiki. You must issue a subpoena. I believe they own. Gomez, no. A Buick. A Buick? <laughs> My name is Gomez Adams, and I have seen evil. Whoa. Uh, look at the baby. <laughs> I have seen the unholy maggots which feast in the dark recesses of the human soul. They're at camp. They're at camp. Oh, uh, yeah, her kids, kids. Hook em, fuck em, cook em. Now! What are we getting arrested for? A Pilgrim's Day, it's Happy Turkey Day! Happy Turkey Day! Sorry, see you Why are we hitting kids? I don't want to be in the pageant. Don't you want to help me realize my vision? You lack any sense of structure, character, cool. or the cool. Aristotelian unities. I have a wonderful idea! Uh-huh. Wednesday and Pugsley and young Mr. Glicker here, they have just never quite latched on to the Chippewa spirit. Isn't oh that my goodness. sad? Yeah. No, they just don't want to be sheeple. We are going to make an example, whether they like it or not. What are you going to do? Oh, yes, back in it again. The Little Mermaid. VHS tapes. He's only a child. Oh. <laughs> so we're... With Watching Disney movies? The Brady Bunch? Is Disney? Was it Annie? Annie's Disney. Did it work? Well, is there anything you'd like to say to everyone? What is it? I'm not perky, but I want to be. I want to smile. Why do you want to be perky? There's a little smile. Yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Stay back! Oh no! My baby! He's a super cute baby with curly hair! <laughs> what happened? I can brain. <laughs> no! It works on cats! It works on cats! He's possessed. Warning signs. Severe alterations in appearance and personality. Such alterations can become permanent. Those golden curls. Uh-huh. These terrifying changes are most often the result of a troubled family life. Oh, trouble with Fester. Unless Fester comes back, we're talking dimples. Oh, not dimples. <laughs> Each summer, we take this occasion to celebrate the first Thanksgiving! Take it away! Let's see what Gary's got here. Wow, this is a bit of a production. Is that Pugsley? Hey, it's Thanksgiving Day! <laughs> eat us, cuz we're good and dead. Go, Pugsley, go! So eat us before we finish this song. Oh my gosh, this is super cute, actually. <laughs> Where are we? Oh, Debbie's grieving. How are we going to kill him this time? That's a big bomb. Okay. Angel, I'll just put your present on the table. Don't peek. Please, please. This is ridiculous. It's a bomb. 
What? It's a bomb. What? You'll be right back, won't you? Of course. Yeah, that's why I'm taking luggage. Why would she blow up the really fancy house? Just a reminder that I'm offering a seven-day free trial to new Patreons. That is where you can find all my full reactions and this exclusive content. These savages are our guests. That's cool. They have a little hole to watch. How? I am Pocahontas. And I am Running Bear, betrothed to Pocahontas. 20 grand for summer camp. 20 grand for summer camp? I am a turkey. Kill me. <laughs> Sit. Wait. What? We what? cannot break bread with you. Oh, that's not part of the play. You have taken the land which is rightfully ours. Oh. Years from now, my people will be forced to live in mobile homes. Oh. The gods of my tribe have spoken. Yeah. They said, do not trust the pilgrims. I've decided to scalp you. Yeah. And burn your village to the ground. Yeah. <laughs> Go Wednesday. Burn it all. Wow. Real fires. Whoa. There goes the last row. Whoop. Almost got him. Yeah. <laughs> wow, gasoline, okay. Yeah. <laughs> the wheelchair person. She's happy now. That's funny. She's all made up like that. Yeah, get her. She's smiling now. <laughs> Good job, kids. Oh my gosh, it's the guy from Star Tr Star Trek thing. I'll be right back. Oh, your husband is a better lucky man. Don't say that. <laughs> she doesn't want him to be lucky. Cheers. Oh, he got rid of the wig. He's bald again. I didn't notice that. We're showing up to watch it explode? My husband was in that house. Uh-huh. <laughs> I hope you get blown up with it. Oh, there goes the house. Boy, that was a waste of money. That was a heck of an explosion. He's Sweetheart, fine. Freeze! I tried to make it look like an accident. What do you say? Uh-huh. I want you dead, and I want your money. Don't you love me? <laughs> look at yourself. Oh. You're a nightmare. Yeah, thing. No woman in her right mind could love you. Yeah, let's go. Ooh, that was a big gun. I'll get you and your little hand too. That's from uh, the... That's from the Wizard of Oz, right? What are we doing? Whatever that was. Come on. Hey, we got out. I have to go back for the others. Joel. I may never see you again. There are forces tearing us apart. Gary, Debbie, mm -hmm. the seventh grade. The seventh grade. I'll never forget you. We'll always have today. And this. Her Amanda's retainer. Mon cher. Ooh! Come on! He stole the van! I hope she gets killed by the Adams. <laughs> Look at then the baby! Step in Her the cat in the hat. Will you enjoy me? child of mine he's still in adams he just he's has cute me. curly hair oh no he lives oh no he li he lives it's gomez oh goodness Sweet chariot. my baby is ill oh yeah he's homesick for his brother right what shall i do gomez where is festa he's right there i try to be someone i'm not in the suburbs. In the suburbs. I am an Adams. Festa. Yeah, but get your regular fat Uncle suit Fester. on. They made us sing. Uh oh. I've missed you all. Good. Whole family together at last. Three generations above ground. Above above ground. Uh oh. Oh, the baby turned evil. I don't enjoy hurting anybody, but sometimes people just won't listen. My parents. What? Sharon and Dave. We get a slideshow. <laughs> All I ever wanted was a ballerina Barbie. And do you know what they got me? Malibu. The nightmare. The nerve. <laughs> That's not 
who I was. Uh-huh. You psychopath. They had to go. Wow. Well, we're cutting our way out. <laughs> I like this baby. An axe. That takes me back. Oh, oh, these are so messed up people. Husband number two. Senator. Who is it? Oh, Senator. Sorry, Debbie. No Mercedes this year. We have to set an example. Debbie's a bit messed up in the head. What are we doing? Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, she's going to kill them all. Oh. I can't tell if it's a bowling ball or a cannonball. I think it's a cannonball. Whoa. Adios, cara mia. For what I've done, I deserve to die. Oh, we're building pressure. This is like a Rube Goldberg thing. <laughs> that wouldn't creep you out at all. Goodbye, everybody. What's they gonna do? Oh, got her instead. Woo, she's turned into ash. Holy crap. Oh. Visa and MasterCard. Some time later. A birthday party. What was I thinking of? Yeah. Physical pleasure. You miss Debbie. Late at night. I remember yeah. how she used to turn to me and say, Jesus, just to go back to your room. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the baby. We brought along a guest. This is our new nanny. Dementia. Oh, dementia. Dementia. Oh, Fester's got a name. new fascination. It means insanity. My name is Fester. It means to rot. Is this for the baby's one year anniversary, one year birthday? To new friends. Oh, we're getting chummy. To youth. How do I look? Disturbing. To passion. Tonight. <laughs> Make way for the birthday boy! Yay! Parents are so involved with each other. Do you think, like, maybe someday you might want to get married and have kids? No. No? What if you met just the right man who worshipped and adored you? I'd pity him. Yeah, that's a good point. Debbie, wife and psycho. <laughs> she was sloppy. What do you mean? If I wanted to kill my husband, I'd do it. You're and right. And I wouldn't get caught. How? I'd scare him to death. We're all very sorry, Debbie. Oh, God! <laughs> she had thinking down there, didn't she? Yeah. Okay. Let's talk about it. That was the Adams Family Values. And uh, the best part of that entire movie was the play. <laughs> By far. The play was fantastic. <laughs> oh, Pugsley is a big turkey, and then her is Pocahontas, and then taking over the play, burning everything down, putting the camp counselors on a spit. That was the best part. <laughs> I, I still don't get the, like, nuttiness of these people. Like, have they, I mean, we know for sure they killed Debbie, but have they killed like a bunch of people? <laughs> he said he was acquitted at one point. I don't know. It's just they're an oddity, right? And I guess it's like, uh, you know, just it's fun to watch them because of the oddity. Boy, the whole Fester Debbie thing. Oh my, wow. That was a problem from the get go. <laughs> I'm glad that's done with. I don't know. I thought it was really fun. Uh, you know, the uh, first one was fun. This one's fun. The whole kid flying through the space and waving at the people in the plane. I'm just like, and he comes down. He's fine. <laughs> They're not killable. Oh, she electrocuted him. And he was fine. Put a light bulb in his mouth. <laughs> Nuttiness. I don't know. What do you think of Adam's family values? Do you enjoy the whole Adams family world and everything around it? Uh, Wednesday was super cute in this movie. She actually like smiled twice, kind of like once for the camp counselors to like trick them, 
And then once at the end, when she was, uh, whatever he is to her boyfriend or whatever, scaring the crap out of him with thing coming out of the ground, <laughs> she kind of had a smirk on her face. But yeah, it's fun. I'll say that it is fun. Um, I recognize only a couple people. I the the guy who is Doc in um Back to the Future. Oh, and he was also the bad guy in Roger Rabbit. Roger Rabbit was a really crazy movie. It was good. And then the like the blonde girl's dad, I think, was in Raising Arizona. I think those are the only two people I recognized. Oh, and then the guy from the oh goodness, I cannot figure it out in my brain. And people are gonna yell at me. The Star Trek like, make fun of the Star Trek rip-off movie. Oh, Galaxy Quest. Oh, thank you. Ugh. The guy from Galaxy Quest, I recognize him as well. But which was very, 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 very small part for him. So I don't know what kind of actor he is. That he played that really tiny role like that. But, um, yeah, I really like this. So thanks to my Patreons for picking this one for Thanksgiving. And, you know, thank all of you, of course, for subscribing and liking the channel. And don't forget that you are awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye.